with body language, when you flow with the girl with your body language, it's usually the most important thing that you're gonna do. Because you could even say all the right lines, but you don't have the right body language, and all of a sudden, she doesn't believe it. All right? So again, we all kind of understand this, this ethereal concept that body language as well, like 70, 80, nonverbal, 70, 80% of communication. Okay? With flirting, it's even more so. All right? If you walk up and you talk to her and you express, how many of us have like, tried to express interest a little bit, but we haven't been flirting? And so it kind of comes off as like, oh, that, that's really interesting. Yeah, I, I like that. That's cool. Okay? Even though you said the right thing, we've all experienced that, right? You said the right words, and she's like, oh, that's cool. You're a nice friend. And even you feel it. You're like, I said the right things, but I'm a nice friend, okay? Because you're not flirting, okay? Let's look at mechanics, all right? First thing, close the distance, okay? You're talking to a girl here, and you're standing off here. I don't care what you're talking about, what you're doing, nothing's happening this distance. Now, especially in a nightclub scenario, you close the distance, okay? Now that means you could just take a step forward. That means you could maybe ask her a question about what she's wearing. That means you could uh, say, I have a secret to tell you, and whisper in her ear, I have a confession to make. It doesn't really matter, but close the distance. 